सो हाय डियर लीब्रा वेरी वेरी गुड इवनिंग टू यू गाइस दिस इज अंजलि टैरो एंड दिस इज अ जर्नल ऑफ रीडिंग फॉर ऑल द लीब्रा सन मून मीनस राइजिंग कीप इन माइंड दिस इज जर्नल इट माइट और माइट नॉट रेसोनेट विद यू एट द फर्स्ट प्लेस द सेकंड थिंग दिस इज अ रीडिंग फ्रॉम टुडे टिल द टेंथ ऑफ अप्रैल फॉर दोस हु आर सिंगल एंड वॉन्ट्स टू नो वट्स कमिंग टू वर्ड्स दैन टिल द टेंथ ऑफ अप्रैल I do the readings by uh, Western Astrology, and if you want to be a professional tarot card reader like me, you can start your journey by purchasing my course. The link is in the description box for the same. Okay, it's Libra reading, and uh, the camera is not falling. It's a surprise. So the camera did its job of falling. Yeah. Anyways, so if you want to start your self uh, self healing journey and wants to learn more about Ho Pono Pono, you can uh, start by purchasing my master class. You are going to learn a lot, and it's going to change your life for the rest of your life. i can assure you that so now let's start libra your current energies regarding love and relationship right now at this present moment are we have the two of pentacles the queen of swords the ace of cups bottom of the deck is the nine of pentacles you're going up and down up and down some day you are very practical some day are like no i need love i need someone by my side who can give me the uh, give me lot of love then another day you are like i don't need love everything is fine my life is perfect i should work on myself i should just do my own things this and that then again you are coming to this energy of okay i want somebody by my side because i cannot survive alone there's something missing in my life that needs to be uh, fulfilled that needs to be completed and i just can't wait for the love of my life to enter in my life so that i can start the new chapter of my life as soon as possible then another day you are like i don't care i don't need anybody i just want to be by my side that's it so this is what is happening right now in your current energies when it comes to love and relationship so uh, right now you are having this hyper independence syndrome where you are like i am independent i am working on myself everything is cool everything is perfect then at the end of the day you are like a normal human being you are like okay i want love anjali i'm tired okay i can understand this happens with a lot of people especially for those who are having a lot of money have a, having a lot of you know uh stability in their life financially they crave for, they crave for love more and more than the, the the one who are in the middle of the journey to be honest with you guys i have seen lot of clients suffering like this i have everything in my life i got my money sorted i got my family issues sorted my health is fine i don't have anybody to share my life with this this kind of thing i have heard a lot from past you know i think 6 uh, 7 months continuously i'm heard hearing this Let's see who's coming towards the Hermit Three of Cups and the Eight of Wands. Someone is planning to come back around. Someone who is continuously thinking about coming back around, and they feel like talking to you, but at the same time they're holding back. It could be somebody who tried uh, in the past and you rejected them, or there were some third party issues in the past and now they feel like coming back to you, but at the same time they're not sure whether you are going to accept or reject, and that is where they feel like okay, okay, they should just keep their mouth shut. So this is definitely somebody whom you already know, and there there was a connection between you guys at some point of time, but because of some kind of third party issues or uh, because of some kind of external influences, that the things fell apart. Now this person is not sure whether they should come back around or not. Now it could be you thinking like this about a particular situation in a particular direction regarding a collaboration partnership with someone, but you might you are holding back. You might be the one holding back this urge to connect with them because you don't know. Uh, how they are going to react or what is going to happen so you are like watching somebody from a distance from a safe distance not even letting them know that you are watching them might be and you are kind of holding back this urge to connect with them but you have this urge to connect with them take it how it resonates with you it could be you it could be somebody else but you know when i'm talking to the, to you about this particular personal situation you know who i'm talking about so i don't see anything changing because your own energies are up and down so you are attracting these kind of up and down energies from the other side also it could be possible here and there you are going to connect with a one two people and then nothing could be very much possible online okay let's see the guidance for you guys libra in the situation we have the emperor the page of pentacles the queen of pentacles You have to stabilize your own energies honey and you have to be little flexible when it comes to love and relationship area. If you are going to be very stubborn like okay, my person or the person I'm going to be with, they should look like that, they should behave like that, they should have this amount of money, they should have this characteristics, they should have this, they should have that. Otherwise, I'm not going to accept them as a lover or even as a friend. 
and if you want love in your life you have to be very flexible because sometimes sometimes a totally different person is going to change your life for the rest of your life and for the best of your life actually so you don't have to be stubborn when it comes to love and relationship not stubborn with yourself like okay i am going to apply this kind of methodology i am going to do the, like this only i am going to give this much love and then i am going to pull back and then i am going to do this that this that so you have a plan you have a strategy you cannot love anybody with a plan or with a strategy love is something that's going to flow and the more you are going to plan and strategize and do this and that the more it's going to slip out of your hands so it's better to be flexible when it comes to the area of love and relationship and better be open open to new experiences new energies as well because the more you are going to try to you know uh, fix it or try to you can you can say what do you call that fixate on it the more it's going to be slipping out of your hands so yeah stability is fine having a good energy is fine having this idea of how it should be fine but sticking to this energy of this should be like this only otherwise it's not valid for me null and nullified or something it's 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 worst it's not going to work out so thank you so much for tuning in uh, libra i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste